London Council bans Donald Trump ahead of UK visit over bigoted attitude. While an official visiting date is yet to be confirmed, the US President is expected to be in the UK in late February for the official dedication of the London's new 750 million American Embassy. After initially being offered a full state visit, which would have involved a meeting with the Queen, his trip has reportedly been downgraded to a working trip over fears of mass protests. Now Greenwich councillors have taken matters into their own hands by banning the U.S. president from entering their borough during any visit. The ban would see the U.S. president unable to visit the Zero Two Arena and the Cuddy Sark, however is unlikely to disrupt his visit to the city. The council, which has a labor majority, adopted a motion calling for any state visit to be scrapped outright, while declaring that should a state visit go ahead, President Trump would not be welcome in the borough. They claimed their reasoning was alarmed at the decision of President Trump to retweet Islamophobic propaganda and sadness at the president's bigoted attitude towards women and ethnic minorities. Leader of the council Denise Hyland said, On a daily basis we work hand in hand with residents from all communities to ensure this borough is a peaceful and welcoming place that celebrates difference and diversity, but in the case of President Trump we are willing to make an exception. We are one of 32 London boroughs, all different all individual but all home to people from across the world. This diversity strengthens our borough. It enriches our lives on a daily basis. And it reminds us all that we have so much more in common than divides us. As one of the most multicultural London boroughs, we are a place that has worked tirelessly to break down barriers. We have no time for people who want to build walls, when we have done so much to break them down. Councillor Chris Kirby, who presented the motion, added, President Trump has regularly expressed abhorrent and aggressive views and in doing so has enabled the spread of division and hatred. We have worked incredibly hard in this borough to build strong community ties across all faiths and backgrounds. President Trump's views, attitude and policies are totally incompatible with that work. As a council we hold responsibility for more than 270,000 residents. We took the view that we could not stand by and watch the level of public debate be poisoned by the rhetoric that the president and others like him have continued to use. We have stood up and made our position clear, there is no place for aggressive, bigoted and hateful rhetoric in the royal borough of Greenwich.